Okay, uh, today I got something kind of different for you. Uh, actually, not really. I mean, something I've done before. Uh, just a basic uh, unboxing from Amazon. Um, this one, though, is a little different. That's why I kind of thought this one might be kind of fun. I uh, got a few different things. Uh, Cyber Monday, which I'm sure everyone was quite familiar with. Uh, it's, you know, one of the busiest shopping days of the year for online. And so I picked up a few things I saw were on sale. Well, actually, one thing was on sale. The rest of it, I think, was regular price. But, you know, I was ordering the one thing. I figured I'd get a few others. Um, they're Christmas gifts. Those other things. So, anyway, let me just get this guy open. And I'll show you a few of the things that I got. So, first of all, we got this. It's a... Uh, it's the DOS Boot uh, DVDs, um, but this is the original uncut miniseries. Uh, what a lot of people I don't think know is that this was a German uh, miniseries uh, originally, and then they've recut it uh, down to make movies and things with it, but it actually, I think the original one's about five hours long. And so it's one of my favorites. I've watched this numerous times. Um, and... Uh, my uh, my girlfriend's mother just found out that she really likes the movie and didn't know there's a mini series. So for Christmas, we got her the DVD of the uh, mini series here. So I'll see if it even uh, shows you on back here. I'll give you a see if we can't read that. Yeah, in the original uncut version, I got uh, show you down here. Yeah, so four hours and fifty three minutes. So yeah, it's, uh, it's quite a long thing, but it's quite good. It's one of my favorites. And so then the other one of the other things I got is we got this uh, USA pan uh, 9 by 13 baking pan with a lid. Um, it's one of those we were over there for uh, her family's house for Thanksgiving. We noticed some of her uh, bakeware was getting a little old, a little beat up. And we like using USA pan. Um, we got a, a few of them, and like I said, it's all made in the USA, which is nice, uh, especially for the, you know, for the for baking or any kind of the food things. We try and buy uh, most things domestic, um, just uh, you know, just just because you you kind of more assured, hopefully that it's you know, safer and uh, contaminated, and also we we do try and you know, um, just support local economies, local businesses. So I'll show you some of the other ones we got here. We haven't used these ones yet, but we're going to uh, plan to make some bread uh, this summer. So we got some of these just uh, baking trays. And then we also had 9 by 13 which we've used this numerous times already. And you can see it still looks brand new. So they're quite good. It's just they do have like a non-stick coating on there. Um, so you can't really use metal on it. But if you use regular, you know, like wood or um, like silicone or plastic, and we got a bunch of like cookie sheets and stuff. And some of them come with racks. Uh, this one's a line uh, called Patriot Pan. Um, it's like their more economy line, but again, still USA made. Um, anyway, uh, so we, we also got our mom some of these as well. So USA Pan, I'm a big fan of... I said, we like it, we use it, it's fantastic. So then the last thing, this is what I got for myself, and this is actually what was, what was on sale. Um, it was like one of their uh, deals. It's uh, the NoCo Boost Plus. Uh, it's a lithium jump starter. Now, since I live in the great white north of Michigan, we have a lot of, uh, you know, cold and snow. And cold, like the heat in the deserts, kills batteries. And so I've had a jump starter in my car for a long time. And I got one, uh, the Harbor Freight version, uh, for my girlfriend's car. And it just happened last week. Um, I was sitting there, and I go to start my car to go to work, and my battery's dead. Uh, again, well, not dead, dead, but, you know, it's just low on power. So I grabbed my jump starter. Uh, it was one of those old uh, lead acid ones, and I went to plug that in up to it, and it turned out that thing was dead. And I just charged it a couple weeks ago, so I need a new jump starter. And so this one was on sale, I think, for $63, which uh, I think was, like, the lowest price it ever had been through Amazon. And so it's got pretty good reviews. I mean, you know, there's a million of these out there. Um, I've used a couple of them. Like I said, the, the Harbor Freight one's fine. Um, I've used a couple of Harbor Freight ones. Uh, but this one, again, it's got good reviews. And I just, I said, I encourage anyone to have one of these in their car. 
Um, just because it's, you know, if you ever need a jump start, like your light goes on or you leave your lights on or anything like that. This thing, it's small, it's compact, you can keep it in there. Um, like I said, the Harbor Freight one, I just checked. We had it for about two years. I think it still had like 85 or 90% power after two years. You know, so you can use, you can charge them once and use them for years afterwards. And uh, yeah, so I got one of these for my truck. And like I said, if you don't have one, I encourage it. Like my, kind of funny, my friend, that same day, uh, she had been in a car accident. Uh, some lady had like rear-ended her car and made the trunk ajar. And so it wouldn't shut properly. So of course, when it's open, it left the light on. So she parked it, you know, not thinking about it, went to go pick it up the next day, battery's dead. So if you had something like that in your car, she could have actually just jumped it and gone on away. Um, so anyway, that's that. Again, you don't have to get this one. Uh, specifically, like I said, it's it's got good reviews. I mean, I'm sure there's all the ones people think are better. I just got it because it's on sale. But again, I highly recommend having a jump starter in all your vehicles. I mean, I keep jumper cables too, but um, at least one of those, you should be good. And then, like I said, then we got the USA Pan. Which, again, I highly recommend these. We've been using them for a while. I think they're fantastic. And I know there's some other bakeware uh, that is made in USA too. Um, but we like these ones. Their price points are pretty good. Um, you can get them, like we got some at Home Goods. Um, and you can get them uh, as a couple stores we like to go to and get them too. So, but USA Pan. And then Das Boot, the original uncut mini series. And not just the movie, but the full mini series. Pretty fantastic. So anyway, I know this is kind of a different one. And uh, it's, you know, I mean, it's a baking pan. It's a jump start and a DVD. But like I said, I kind of figured, you know, maybe you might not have heard about those pans and maybe you don't know about jump starters. And hopefully, like I said, this will be some things to help you out. So that's all. Thanks. Bye.